I suppose if someone had said to me at the end of September you'd, you'd score as many runs as you had and kind of come away with a Lions chance and, and then the opportunity to lead the Lions, I would have kind of snapped with the hand off. Um, if somebody had said there would be a Test 100 waiting a couple of weeks later, I, I would have jumped all over it. So it's been, been a surreal, I suppose, seven, eight months. Um, and to, to top it off the way it has with, with a Test cap and a Test 100 on top, it's, it's kind of the best Christmas present I could get, really. You walked out to bat with someone who's opened the batting so often for England that the most experienced partner you could have imagined now is to cook. Was there anyone in particular you talked to before the game, anyone personally, family or, or a professional colleague, just to get some advice about this particular game? Uh, there's, there's probably a few people. Chatted to, to my dad, my uncle. Uh, in, in, in terms of the players, chatted a little bit to Cookie, to Ruti. They, they had some good advice on their bowlers. Uh, Stokesy as well. So I suppose as, as a kind of combination of people, there was kind of my little support structure that I, that I always go to, my brother, um, my dad. Um, so, I mean, besides them, I, I didn't try and branch out to, to anyone that I hadn't dealt with before um, and, and just try to keep it very simple and the, the same kind of process that I've gone through for the past six or seven months. You're now in the, the enviable position of <laughs> batted once and 100. Just how will you sort of approach you know, the, the rest of your test career in the, in the immediate term? Is it something you'll try and if you like, keep hold of that high in the short term, or will you just try and forget it and the second innings is a whole new thing? I think generally I'm, I'm quite a mellow bloke. I don't try and make my highs too high or my lows too low, because I think you can get leveled quite quickly with cricket. Um, I think I'd, I'd, I'd like to say I'd, I'd, I'd approach every innings in the same way, or hopefully I can approach it in the same way as I did today. Um, but yeah, I suppose you only know when, when you get put in that position and, and, and how you will, you'll react in that position.